what you guys got another video here for you in this one we're going to be taking a look at fixing the bad system info error which you can see inside windows 10 basically when you're booting up you're going to get this bad system config info uh, error coming up here and uh, what we're going to do is try to fix this today by using uh, some commands in command prompt now what will happen is it will try to uh, boot the system up it will go into preparing automatic repair like you see here and uh, basically uh, once you get here it will try to fix it you're going to diagnosing your PC here which is pretty normal and then it won't be able to diagnose and fix it and you will end up in the same uh, error message here now it will give you the automatic repair here click on options and we'll continue here and uh, you'll end up with the same error message on boot up as it goes to boot up again you'll get that blue screen uh, with the same error message and there you go and this is going to be continuous for you uh, until uh, we get to repair it so you can see the bad system config info down the bottom it will try to repair it again and then it will be into a reboot loop so we're going to let it do the uh, preparing automatic repair one more time here and then what we're going to try and do uh, is go into troubleshoot afterwards now if you don't want to do this part you can also boot to uh, a Windows CD if you wanted to uh, but we're going to try and do it from the troubleshoot uh, area first so what we're going to do here is click on advanced options here so what you want to do here is we want to go into troubleshoot now and uh, you can also boot to the Windows uh, disk if you want to create one of those and boot to that if you wish uh, but we're going to do it this way I'm going to go here and go into advanced options from here now your system restore is not going to work if you haven't got that enabled you're going to have no system restore points and uh, you also may run into trouble when you do troubleshoot here and you try reset this PC and uh, you can see here we have keep my files and remove everything here so if I do keep my files you'll probably see this is going to come back with an error and you can see here there was a problem resetting your PC no changes were made so you can push cancel and this is going to bring you back to the troubleshoot area here go into advanced options here and uh, we're going to go into we've already done the startup repair that didn't work I'm going to go into command prompt here and uh, what we need to do here is we're going to get to our directory for our windows and it's it's probably going to be in D here so we're going to changed it by typing D colon and then type DIR and we should see our Windows directory here and uh, what we're going to do from here is going to try a few commands so we're going to do CD and then space and then D colon it's a bit of a lengthy uh, bit of a lengthy process um, but it's worth doing if you want to try to fix it okay with without formatting and losing all your data so we're going to put system32 and then another backslash here and then config and what that's going to do is change that directory to there okay so you can see we're now we're in this directory which is uh, where we want to be next up we're going to go MD make directory and it's going to call backup like so now that's created a, a directory called backup inside here okay so I want to do copy here I'm meant to put a dot start dot star all files and then backup like so there you go so we're gonna basically copy all those files into our backup folder okay that's what that's done you can see 11 files has been copied into there so what we need to do next is uh, change back to our regback folder so we're going to do change directory which is CD and then do regback and there's a folder or directory on your system uh, called regback and that's where it's taken us back there to now so what we want to do next is do copy again 
and then space and then star dot star and then space and then dot dot like so and it will say do you want to overwrite I'm gonna say uh, yes so we can say a for all if you want to do that uh, or you can say yes and go through them individually so we'll just do a here and uh, go all and it's gonna copy all of those ones into there okay now what we need to do next is go exit and we we'll exit out of that and uh, we're gonna to try to uh, go back and reboot our computer so we're gonna turn off your PC and then just let the uh, windows boot up okay and hopefully with this booting up now we should have rectified our problem and there we are we're back up and running and that issue is now being resolved So that's basically how you can fix the uh, bad system config info error, blue scheme error, where you're getting a continuous reboot loop and it's a quick and easy way to fix it. Okay. Anyway, I hope this one helps you out, guys. I hope this uh, fixes all your problems. If you've got any problems that you are still having, then pop over to the forums and I'll try and help you out over there. Anyway, I'm going to wrap this one up. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Thanks again for watching, guys, and thanks for your continued support. I shall see you for another video again shortly. Bye for now.